out this series and complete the upset. Wow. And you know the home fans are smelling blood. They're actually ready to taste the spoils of a series win. But it's going to take some work. And that's going to have to happen between the lines. But the fans can play a part by being vocal and energized throughout. And they will be, Clark, I'm sure, because they want to see their guys celebrating on their home floor when this one's over. Not packing their bags for game seven. Look at the Magic starting group. Arenas and Richardson pair up and gets the call for going over the top. Yeah, he practically tackled him. I mean, he was draped all over him. Dude. That was an easy one. And the basket good. Uh, if he gets a glimpse of an opening, he's going to take it right to the rim. Now Arenas averaging 14 points a game. Pass up top. Pocket six. Richardson against four. Hit one on the clock. Here is Arenas. Under four minutes left in the first quarter of the game. To the paint. Pass. In for the dunk. Shot clock at six. Here's Turkaloo. Any connection. Boy, it's been a bad quarter for him shooting the ball. The game is not coming to him right now. No flow or rhythm at all. Turkaloo outside. Moving it around nicely. Back and down is Howard. Covered by Hibbert. Dives again. Richardson. He's covered by Collison. Howard against Hibbert. Again, a minute left in the first. Turkaloo with it. Right now averaging seven points a game. He dishes it to Anderson. Just five on the clock. The Pacers pull it in. He's probably better suited sending the ball back out to a teammate because that's not his game right there. Here's Ford, and it's going to be two free throws. Drew contact on the shot. It's on Hito Turkaloo, and he knocks down the first one. That's also good, so he hits both free throws. I think they've got to be more disciplined here, Kevin. Already way too many fouls and too many free points for the opponent. Shot and game clock separated by five. Turkaloo right side. The Magic again can't hit. When he's wide open like that, he'll rarely miss those. Here is Ford. for tuning in as we get back to the action of our broadcast here of Game 6. And now let's check out the lineups courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up and ready to go. Here's the second quarter to play. And so in the game for the pace themselves to get picked too easy. Ford is screen on help. Ford kicks to Hansbrough. Ford. Some 
Nice pass. Hansborough, that's good. Tipped away. And stolen by Williams. Jumps in and he slams it home. Here's the replay on the spike slam camp. Now that's just rubbing it in, fella. Throwing it down with style. Uh, and it's Ford with the rebound. Well, that's clearly a situation you want to make sure you don't give him too good of a look at. It. Not true. The defenders shouldn't relax just because he missed that one. Back and down is Howard. He gathers. Soft touch. Collison pitched to four. Collison, good. Collison's got his first points of the night. Yeah, we're now starting to see them get some high percentage shots in the paint. Yeah, that's five of their last six buckets inside the lane, so they're getting really high percentage looks down there. Now here's Turkaloo. Here's Clark. Just five to shoot. And the clock winding down. Kicks it out to Turkaloo. Puts up a three. But they'll get another chance. Hangs in the air. That's good. Over four. Shot misses. And Indiana will go the other way with it. Well, neither team has really gained an edge rebounding-wise here, and the score reflects that. Well, one really focused and intense and generated some nice opportunities. And blocked. Indiana trailing here. Slowing it down here. Smart. Play for the last shot of the court. Yeah, I like that. I mean, dribble it down to six seconds or so and then go. That way you got a chance for a second shot if you did. Well, credit the defense, but you've got to be more careful with the ball. And the Pacers call time here. Gets it off. Shot is no good. It's a tie game in Indiana. We hope you're enjoying your Memorial Day. 2K Sports, happy to have you with us. So on the floor for Orlando, Jason Richardson and Hito Jerkalu are at the two and three. Brandon Bass is out there with Howard, and it's Arenas in at the one spot. Four dishes to Hansbro. He passes to four. They're moving the ball. Guarded by Howard. For the lead. Count it and the foul. Tipped. I really don't like what I'm seeing there last couple of possessions, Kevin. Two turnovers. And he puts it down with authority. Spike slam cam for another angle. Boy, that dunk got everybody up off their seat. They've got to continue their work on the glass. Yeah, I agree with you, Steve. I mean, they're on the right side of the ledger, and that is all that matters to them right now with the lead they have. Howard with a screen on Collis. Turkaloop kicks it over to Arenas. Six on the shot clock. Started by four. To end the run. It's blocked. Offense by Orlando. He's really lacking in confidence out there. Zero field goals made so far in this game. When the drought. Here's Bass. So it's Indiana. A finish. Yes! What a finish with the reverse. Getting into the paint. They're getting whatever they want offensively. Oh! Jams it with authority. Oh, he's got enough. Turkaloo against Hansbrook. From deep, Richardson. It is good. The Let's it go with a three. No what? I like the defense, guys. Really getting a hand up and challenging shots. Yes, yeah, Steve. Lurking on that shot, and that was a tough one. Pace of shots continuing to fall as we conclude the third quarter. In the outstanding performance of their two guard. He's led the way in the scoring department for his team as he's carried them through the first three quarters in this one. We'll see if he can continue that in the fourth. Good stuff, Doris. You know, Clark, he has really been the engine driving them today. You know, quite honestly, they wouldn't be in the position they're in right now if it weren't for him, Kevin. Yeah, they've been really leaning heavily on him, and, and he's come through in a big way, guys. Four in a shooting guard. Rush out there with Josh McRoberts. There's Collison, and it's Hibbert in at the center, filling out the middle. That's the Pacers' five. Shakes him. So the whistle blows on the shot to go. 
So far, he hasn't made much of a contribution at the offensive end. Here is Anderson. Feeds it to Redden. Started by four. And here's Turkaloo for three. Help that straight points inside, too. Dishes it to Duhon. No one near him. The feet to rush. The tray. And that one's good. Again, can't hit. Pacers leading by six. And here is four. Two minutes. Turkle who picks him up. Shoot it, shoot it. Hands throw inside. Richardson got the foul. Forge got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Gilbert Arenas covering. Over Arenas. Ford, no luck. He's laboring out there right now, guys. The shot has not been falling for him this quarter. And here's Richardson outside. Buries it. Oh, and that cuts the lead to just five. Well, I think it takes a lot of guts to shoot the three on the fast break with a guy closing out on him. Oh, Ford. And there's the pass to Hansbrough. Defended by Turkle. Throw the pass to four. Trying to come right back with the three of his own. It's no good. And now we've got the intentional foul. Here is Ford. And they go to the intentional foul. Sinks the first one, and that increases their lead to six. for two and it's a seven point ball game. Nice job to make them all. That's a big play to extend their lead. Now a timeout called by Orlando. They're behind by seven. We've got 28 seconds left in the game. Here's Turkle. That's going to be over and back. Not watching for the line that time. 27 seconds left to play here in the fourth. Shot on the wing. Nito Turkoglu with the rebound. I think you've got to find another way to contribute, Kevin, besides looking to shoot the ball. I mean, he just can't get anything to bounce his way this quarter, so he's got to do other things. A 10-footer. Here's Arenas. Sinks it. Well, that's a nice job on the boards to allow them a second high-quality look. Here is Ford. And now they decide to foul intention. Good on the first, and that increases their lead to six. Perfect from the line, and it's a seven-point ball game. Here's Arenas. On deep. And that's going to do it for this series. They'll move on. And you can see the elation on their faces. I mean, not just happiness, but pure excitement and joy to be headed to the NBA Finals. A tremendous opportunity now, just four wins away from a championship. I and mean, guys, tonight, time to celebrate, enjoy the win, and then tomorrow it's uh, back to the practice court, into the film room, and uh, time to prepare for, for what's ahead. But uh, what, what a moment tonight, and a great time for this franchise. And they'll represent the East in a final series that's mere days away. And that about wraps it up for Clark Kellogg, Steve Kerr, and Doris Burke, and the whole crew from 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan saying so long, and thanks for watching the NBA Eastern Conference Finals. Now let's take a look at the Jordan player of the game.
When I enter the center stage, the show's over. Minutes later, the floor's frozen, the rose rolls up. I'm demonstrating the coke flow, but I'm so sober. The original renegade before Hover. They like, damn, why Dre never get him? He seemed like so much anger and pain represent him. Eminem himself will tell you I'm the only nigga living that can ever spanked him on the same record with him. Your man's getting jealous, cause what I'm spitting is sicker than the single. He gotta think of a dance just to sell it. This is street hop to the fullest to them real niggas out there on them corners beatboxing with bullets. Way to complete the comeback. You guys were down a couple of games and still managed to move on. How was this team able to make that happen? That was one of the toughest series I've ever been involved in for sure. I think the biggest thing was that we stuck to our game plan even when we were down. We know that if we play our game, we can beat any team in the league. And even if a game or two doesn't go our way, that doesn't mean we need to panic and abandon what's worked for us so long, you know? And to our credit, we didn't. And look where we are now. Really proud of these guys, man. Really proud. And definitely looking forward to the next challenge.